and Ruby. Ruby and Max. Max and Ruby. Ruby and her little brother Max. Perfect Christmas tree. Well, here we are at Santa's tree land. This is so exciting, Grandma. I can't wait to pick out our Christmas tree. Can you, Max? Max? Hello, and welcome to Santa's tree land, where not only can you pick out your very own tree, you can also meet Santa Claus. We are here to find the best Christmas tree you've got, Mr. Huffington. Well, you've come to the right place, Ruby. We've got all kinds. I know what kind I want. Perfect. And what does your perfect Christmas tree look like, Ruby? You know, Grandma. Nice and tall, not crooked at all, and bushy all the way around. In other words, just perfect. perfect. Well, you'd better hurry. They're going like hotcakes. <gasps> Santa Claus. Look how long that lineup is, Max. If we wait in line, all the best Christmas trees will be gone. Now, it won't take us long to find our tree, and by the time we get to Santa, the lineup will be gone. Good. Hmm. This one is bushy all the way around, <gasps> but too small. <sighs> Ooh. This one is nice and tall, <laughs> but it's all crooked. Hmm. This is going to be harder than I thought. <sighs> huh? Hi, Roger. Hi, Mr. Piazza. Hi, Ruby. Hi, Ruby. Looks like you found a nice Christmas tree. Uh-huh. Are you going to see Santa now? Sure am. Oh, I hope we can find a tree as nice as that. Now, don't worry. We will. Okay, Grandma. Max, where are you going? Santa Claus. <laughs> I want to see Santa too. And we will, as soon as we find our perfect Christmas tree. <gasps> I think this might be it. Well, it, it's hard to tell until we brush the snow off. You want to help? We need to see if it's bushy all the way around. <laughs> <laughs> now we have to brush the snow off you. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Grandma. It's nice and tall. And not crooked at all. And it's bushy on this side. How about your side, Max? Max? Hmm. Where did he go? Oh! Hi, Max. Where are you off to? Santa Claus. Of course you are. <laughs> Max! Someone's eager to see Santa Claus. I've got good news. I think we found our perfect Christmas tree. Come and look. Then we can go straight to Santa. Right down here. Someone else found our tree. Well, there are lots more trees here. It, uh, what do you think of this one? Hmm, too bushy. <sighs> Way too crooked. Hi, Ruby. Hi, 
Louise. Hi, Morris. You found your Christmas tree. We sure did. And now we're going to see Santa Claus. We'll be there as soon as we find our Christmas tree. Okay. Bye, Ruby. Bye, Louise. Grandma, look at this tree. Ooh. It's nice and tall, not crooked at all, and bushy all the way around. In other words, just perfect. <laughs> What do you think, Max? Santa Claus! Oh, no. Not again. Louise! What's the matter, Ruby? You've got a passenger. Huh? Max! What are you doing there? Santa Claus! Don't worry, Max. You'll get to see Santa Claus sooner than you think. Grandma and I found the perfect tree. Come and see. It's nice and tall and not crooked at all. It's right. <gasps> oh no! They're taking our perfect tree. Don't worry, Ruby. Now we'll find another one. I know, Grandma. We just have to keep looking. Oh. <laughs> Santa Claus! Do you see one you like, Ruby? Not yet, Grandma. And this is the last row. Uh, what about this one? Hmm. I guess it doesn't have to be a perfectly perfect tree. This one's almost perfect. Once you get the decorations on, I'm sure it'll look just beautiful. That's true, Grandma. Well, what do you think, Max? <laughs> Max! Santa Claus! <laughs> oh! So, what did you ask Santa Claus for? <gasps> oh, my! It's my perfect Christmas tree! Max's Christmas presents. Come on, Max. <laughs> Louise is going to help us make our Christmas tree decorations. It's all laid out on the kitchen table. What is it? It's a cardinal. It's probably looking for food. In the winter, there aren't any berries and seeds on the trees for birds to eat, so they have to work extra hard to search for food. That's why I always carry bird seed to feed the birds in the winter. Here you go. Merry Christmas, Mr. Cardinal. We'd better get inside and start making decorations. Good idea. Grandma said she'd come over soon to help us put them on the tree. Max? Do you want to help us make our decorations? I bet ours will be the only Christmas tree with all natural decorations. Decorating the Christmas tree is one of the things I love best at Christmas time. Me too. But I also love Christmas cookies and stockings hung by the fireplace and Christmas presents. <laughs> <laughs> Max's favorite thing at Christmas is seeing the presents under the tree. But first we need to decorate the tree. We've almost finished this cranberry garland. It looks beautiful, Ruby. I know. A few more cranberries and we'll be done. There. I think that's enough now. I hope so. We've used up all the cranberries. If you take the cranberry garland and put it on the sofa in the living room, Louise and I can make the next garland. Then we'll be ready to decorate the tree faster. 
Thanks, Max. <gasps> Don't drag it on the floor. Max, don't you want to help with the decorations? Oh, well. Next, the gingerbread men. <laughs> Christmas presents. First, we need to give our gingerbread men faces. All natural faces, right, Ruthie? <laughs> <laughs> right, Louise. <laughs> huh? What's that? <laughs> well, you asked him not to let the end drag on the floor. <laughs> Red men look handsome and yummy. <laughs> Christmas presents. Max, those are for our decorations. See? And we have to finish decorating the tree before we can put Christmas presents under it. There, that's the last one. It's ready to go. You want to take this garland to the living room, too? Max! <laughs> <laughs> I guess he got tired of helping with the decorations. <gasps> or maybe not! Careful, Max! Popcorn garland will make our Christmas tree look so wintry. And it's all natural. Huh? Oh, you're pulling the garland, Louise. I'm not pulling it. Well, if you're not pulling it, and I'm not pulling it... Max? Christmas presents? I know you want to put the Christmas presents under the tree. But you'll have to be patient a little while longer. We have to finish this garland first. It'll just be a second. There, all finished. Now you can take it to the living room. Ah, oh, little brothers. Thank you, Max. Grandma will be here soon and we'll be all ready to decorate the tree. Christmas presents! <laughs> I can't wait to see how the all-natural decorations look on your Christmas tree, Ruby. We don't have to wait long. Grandma should be here any second. Come on. Our Christmas tree is going to look so beautiful. <gasps> Where did all the decorations go? I don't know. Huh? Max? What a beautiful Christmas tree! What do you mean, Grandma? Oh, just take a look! <gasps> Our all natural decorations! What are they doing out here? 
looks like they're making a lot of hungry winter birds very happy. <laughs> we thought we were making Christmas tree decorations. But it turns out we were making the birds some delicious Christmas presents. Max and Ruby's Christmas Carol. This is the perfect spot for us to practice our special bunny Christmas carol. Why here, Ruby? Because nobody will hear us when we practice. And then, as soon as we know all our parts perfectly, we can go from store to store to sing it for every bunny. Good idea, Ruby. I know I need to practice. <laughs> Okay, I've got everything right here. <gasps> Bell! Max, there's even a part for you in our Christmas carol. Max? If you come here, I'll show you. Your part is to ring the bell. <gasps> bell? Yes. Here's your bell. Won't that be fun? Now, here's the song sheet. You're so organized, Ruby. And wait till you see what Grandma got for us. Wow. Oh, candles! They're beautiful! Now we can see our song sheet perfectly. Okay, does everybody remember how it goes? Uh, can you remind us, Ruby? Sure. We sing two verses, and then Max will ring the bell, and then we sing Merry Christmas to Everybody. Got it? Got it! to ring the bell, but you have to ring it at the right time. We sing, when you hear the Christmas bell ring, and we listen for the bell, and that's when you ring your bell. Perfect! And after you ring your bell, we all sing, Merry Christmas to everybody. When we can do the whole thing perfectly, then we'll go from store to store and sing it to everybody. Got it? Got it! Every bunny come along Join our bunny Christmas time song Ring a ling ding dong Join our bunny Christmas time song Every bunny come and sing When you hear the Christmas bell ring Ding dong ring a ling When you hear the Christmas bell ring Not again. <laughs> Bell! No, Max! You're not supposed to ring that bell. That's the big bell they ring when they want everybody to come for something really important. This is the bell you're supposed to ring. The Christmas bell. Now you remember, right, Max? You ring your bell after we sing the line, When you hear the Christmas bell ring. Then we all sing, Merry Christmas to everybody. Got it? <laughs> Thanks, Max. All right, let's try this again. Bell. Everybody come along, join our bunny Christmas time song. Ring a ling ding dong, join our bunny Christmas time song. Every bunny come and sing when you hear the Christmas bell ring. Ding dong, ring a ling, when you hear the Christmas bell ring. 
not supposed to ring that bell. You're supposed to ring your little Christmas bell. We have to practice before we can go from store to store and sing it for every bunny. Um, Ruby? I don't think we have to go from store to store to sing for every bunny. What do you mean, Louise? Every bunny's come to us. I guess they heard the bell and thought something really important was happening. Oh, no. What's going on, Ruby? We were practicing our special bunny Christmas carol, and Max was supposed to ring his little Christmas bell, but instead he rang the big bell. Yes. So we heard. We wanted to practice till it was perfect. <gasps> but I guess we've practiced enough and we're ready now. Right, Max? <laughs> Hello, everybody. Louise and Valerie and Max and I would like to sing you our special bunny Christmas carol. Cool. Oh, oh wonderful. wonderful. Perfect. This sounds like the perfect time to light the town Christmas tree, don't you think? Yes, yes. Wonderful. Yes. Wonderful. Wow. Wow. Terrific. <laughs> Are you ready, Louise and Valerie? Ready, ready Ruby. Ruby. And Max, you know what to do, right? Bell. Right. Every bunny come along, join our bunny Christmas time song. Ring a ling ding dong, join our bunny Christmas time song. Every bunny come and sing when you hear the Christmas bell ring. 